Hello everyone. So as I said I was gonna do a little quick series on life hacks or situations that I go through and they seem interesting to me and I think about them a little bit. So the other day I went with my sister-in-law to rock climbing. We were climbing and I've noticed that she is actually a way better climber than she allows herself to be. The defining factor was the fear that she was feeling and the fear of falling. Um, so we started doing some leads, she did really well and she wanted me to lead this harder climb so she can go after me and follow. But I was like, no, you go and do it, you can do it. She did it and it was fine, she was super stoked that she tried it. It's such a pity that people tend to um, limit themselves because of fear. You know, fear is something that is there to protect us, but it also holds us back from achieving our full potential. What I have found through my snowboard career is fear is there and it's always going to be there and it's how you deal with it. I feel fear when I try to do new tricks. I definitely am scared of hitting big jumps, but I put myself into the situation that after a while it just gets easier and first time I do a 900 it's probably pretty scary and second time, third time, even the tenth time it's the, still the same scary but I feel like I can do it and I calm down a little bit more. You cannot expect to get better at dealing with uncomfortable situations by not taking any steps towards it so if you want to get better and dealing with uncomfortable feelings, you have to face these feelings little by little. And then, after a while, this becomes a way smaller problem than it was at the beginning. So what I have told her, that she just needs to go up and fall, and fall, and fall, and fall again. To become a better climber, to become a more consistent and great leader. Once you actually start doing things that feel uncomfortable, you're gonna be okay with doing more uncomfortable stuff in every aspect of your life. It also depends on the state of mind. When you're tired and you feel like you wanna go home, that is not a time to actually push yourself. And you don't always, the whole day, have to push yourself. You push yourself a couple times during the session, you're proud of yourself, and then, can do the same thing next day. After a while, it's just going to be super chill. I challenge you to do something that you're not comfortable with today. Uh, it might be as small as talking to somebody that you don't know, uh, buying a coffee for someone, saying something to somebody that you want to say for a little while. And I'm excited to hear about it so you can write it in the comments. Learn something new every day and challenge yourself a little bit and let me know how did it go. That's my take on dealing with uncomfortable situations. Don't forget to follow my channel if you like the videos. I'll see you next time.